Hemant. Thanks for joining us at STTV6 through our partner TV studio in New Delhi. Hemant, we all know that India is the world's largest democracy. Its general elections process has already commenced and the voting will continue for almost a month and a half. I think this long polling schedule has shaken up the social media platforms. What's this noise about the messaging service WhatsApp having launched an India-dedicated fact-checking feature? Uh, Seb, in the, in the recent days um, uh, in India, uh, the Facebook itself and Facebook-owned messaging service WhatsApp have come under a severe criticism for allowing uh, circulation of false and distorted information and rumors um, feigning uh, some serious uh, mishaps. In fact, Facebook uh, had stated uh, some time back that in light of the ensuing parliament uh, elections, um, uh, I beg your pardon, parliamentary elections, it, it, it uh, went ahead and removed several Facebook uh, accounts and FB pages for synchronized uh, fabricated uh, uh, misconduct. There, uh, uh, India had has recently uh, divulged that that by using uh, the tools of artificial intelligence and uh, machine learning uh, processes, they have been able to remove um, uh, approximately one million accounts a day. Uh, this has been. Uh, the the concern even in 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 the other parts of, of the world as well especially uh, during their national elections uh, now whatsapp messaging uh, app has launched this fact finding service which you were talking about or feature uh, that uh, would uh, curtail fake news and rumor mongering which 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 could adversely affect the uh, the election process perhaps even its outcome but don't you think that this interferes with the right to access information freely how does this feature no work? i don't think uh, this feature is in breach of any prevailing legislation nor, nor does it tantamount uh, to moral uh, policing because it does not prohibit the flow of information it it merely regulates uh, it mainly regulates uh, the, the information in a way that the users can check the genuineness or truthfulness of the, the received messages or the messages what they, what they receive on the platform. Uh, by forwarding the same to a prescribed WhatsApp account, the response will then uh, specify if the information is uh, true, false, misleading, disputed or out of scope. And uh, commendably, uh, indeed, uh, you know, WhatsApp will be able to examine even the pictures, video links or texts in different languages. Uh, the main language, Hindi, English and even vernacular languages like Telugu, Bengali, Malayalam uh, uh, and, and so on. Thank you, Hemant, for taking the time out of your busy schedule to edify our viewers. We may need you again, possibly tomorrow, on another issue.